The moment is now. Are you ready? Ready to own the land, air and sea. Let's play armies. My name is Vlad Funimedi from Budapest, Hungary. Today, the mission which will be shown is the birds that pray. It is the 25th mission in the mission catalog. In this mission you have to use your jet to capture a sea vessel in the deep sea and use your helicopter to capture your opponent's marine on coastal waters or any sea active vessel. For this I prepared a good setup which can help me to fulfill the first part, the second part of the mission. Uh, so I planned some step before. So that's it. Let's see how will the computer accepted my setup. So we can start. Okay, I'm waiting for the opponent's movement. It, actually, it doesn't matter which is the step because it is planned that way. So I move my marine here. In this case, I I hope I I force the enemy to capture my marine with his marine. In this case, I can use my helicopter to capture the marine in coastal water. That's why I fulfill the second part of the mission. That was the case, so he accepted my sacrifice uh, with the marine, so I can move my helicopter to capture the marine in the coastal water. Here it is. So, the mission second part is now fulfilled. Let's see what happens next. He captured my helicopter with his president. So, let's see how. Let's find out how to proceed. To actually to force the opponent to move his uh, sea vessels in the deep sea, I it, I have to move my sea vessels as well in the deep sea. That is my experience, so that's why I move my submarine. I move my mover to move my submarine to the coastal water and later in the deep sea. Okay. I move my submarine in a good position in the deep sea and I will sacrifice it if needed to capture by my jet. He moved his army. Actually, the situation is not bad for me. So, let's see what else I can do. I will move my army to try to capture the flag in the end. So, getting closer to the flag. That is my plan. He moved his jet in the east uh, corner, the seaside corridor. So, the situation is that now getting interesting. Hmm. Maybe I 
try to capture the marine with my vice president, actually putting a threat on the marine, so let's see what happens. I think he will move he will move it in a coastal water which is a good place for him. So it's now not a big problem for me so I can move some of my pieces in the expanse maybe. Or hmm. I will move my nuke forward. It can help me if I activate it. It can help me to to clear the way to the flag. Okay, he moved his submarine with his mover. So I sacrifice can be a good thing. Actually, the his marine in the coastal water in the it, it can be a problem. So maybe I have to sacrifice my marine to neutralize this threat so it can be a interesting movement. I defend it with my president so actually it can it will be actually on exchange so that's it. So I can move my jet freely and if he moves his submarine then to capture my submarine then I can build up a good position to capture it. So let's see how to proceed. Now. Okay. So I have to wait for the submarine to come. So I push forward my nuke in the expanse. He moved his president, which is not a threat for now. So I can move my nuke again. moved his army which is which can be a problem for me but not now make sure I block the route for the army right now so it's not a problem So I move my nuke again. He moved his submarine. Good. So let's see what else I can do. I think I will move my aircraft carrier in the deep sea. Just to to have new um, 
new uh, sacrifices if I need it. So I move my nuke again. He neutralized my nuke with his child. So It can, I cannot use it now, but I move my child to to uh, block the president roots in the way. Okay, so I can move my army without any threat. Later, it will be a good situation. Let's see what can he do. Okay. I try to put more non military forces here to block the way of the president and the vice president. Okay, it is now almost good, but my child is in a good, uh, wrong position, so that's why I have to move it. And after that I can use my jet to capture the submarine. So I moved away my child. He moved his president, but it's not a problem for me. So in this time I fulfilled the first part of the mission, so I captured an active sea vessel in deep sea by my jet. Here is, so my only thing to do is to win the game. Okay, let's concentrate on the situation here. So I can move my army here, which is getting closer to the flag. Move the way his vice president because I put a threat on that. Okay. I'm getting very close to the flag now. It can be an interesting situation. He captured my jet. It's now, not a problem, because I will if I block the vice president, then Then I can move here, but the situation is different now. Actually, I could capture the vice president, but I made a mistake and did not recognize it. So let's try to do in different way. Mm -hmm. Mm 
I have to move away my child to to put a threat on the, on the vice president. So I put here. Let's see what happens. Okay, now I can capture the vice president. The next one will be the reserve, if needed. Actually, he defended, defended it. So, let's find out how to proceed. I will use my child to block the vice, the president. Okay, he moved his new, which is not a threat right now for me, so I captured the reserve. And the next one will be the flag. And that's it. I fulfilled the two part, parts of the mission capturing uh, marine in the coastal water and capturing uh, sea vessel in the deep sea. Now I fulfilled the other part of the mission is to capture the flag of the opponent. So I won the game. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.